fly outside a busy Bardo County truck stop. The GBI confirming tonight both Emerson police officers and Bardo County Sheriff's deputies were involved. Good evening, I'm Tom Hayes. And I'm Marissa Mitchell. We begin tonight with the newest details on that officer involved shooting in Emerson that put one man in the hospital. News Edge reporter Denise Dillon has details. This truck stop is always very busy. It's right off the interstate. You can see you've got your loves there, a Subway, a McDonald's. Now, police say they were called here this evening after someone said a man was in the parking lot and he had a gun. Just a little while ago, I talked to the man who made that phone call. They told him to put his gun down. He didn't, and they shot him. Jeff Stubbs stood in the parking lot of the Love's truck stop in Emerson. Now a crime scene. Much of the lot cordoned off with police tape. An officer involved shooting. Jeff Stubbs says his brother-in-law was the man who was shot. And Stubbs says he's the one who called police on him. He got in a fight with his wife last night and pulled a gun on her. And my niece told him to leave. Well, he left. He stole the gun. He was coming back today to get his stuff and leave, and then uh, he started talking all kinds of nonsense about, well, I might as well just shoot myself. And that's when I called the police. Stubbs says he told police they could probably find the brother-in-law here at the Love's truck stop. Stubbs says he was told by police that when they showed up, they told him to drop his gun. He did not, and he was shot. Oh, he's still alive in operating room. As far as that, I don't know anything else. Emerson's police chief told me that no officers were hurt. The GBI has taken over this investigation. In Emerson, Denise Dillon, Fox 5 News.